do subscribe to Ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering, HSE and IIT JE main and advanced videos. Hello students, today we are studying chapter human respiration. In that, we are studying topic occupational lung diseases. Today we will be studying two diseases, silicosis and asbestos, which are caused due to occupation. Let's study about it today. Occupational diseases or occupational lung diseases. When I say that term, it means diseases which one can get by being in certain occupation or certain profession. Is it possible to get a disease just by mere of being in a certain profession? Yes. Now, missionaries, mineries, or people who are involved in construction of buildings, especially people who carry bricks, cements, all those people are prone to getting infectious diseases especially silicon compounds present in cement in certain brick compounds if inhaled continuously may chap your respiratory system or you can say they may conclave your respiratory system they will block all the tracheal pharyngeal nostril regions and inhalation or exhalation would get difficult in the long run persistent cough persistent cold inability to breathe properly are some of the symptoms of this silicosis may also lead to the development of tuberculosis in long run if not taken care pulmonary hypertension development of bp which is not always constant are the secondary symptoms of silicosis another occupational disease is asbestos and they are obtained or one get infected to this due to the intake of asbestos particle which may be involved or produced in petrol refineries due to the burning of petrol and diesel or crude oil which is not purified properly. Occupational diseases. Now, occupational diseases can also be termed as occupational lung diseases, which one gets or infest due to working at certain places in certain conditions. Inhalation of pollutants at workplace can cause an occupational disease, which is termed as silicosis. Now, silicosis is caused by the inhalation of silicon particles, especially during working at construction sites or building workplaces, offices, buildings, basically machineries. Now, machineries are the people who construct your houses, workplaces, offices, and they are in continuous contact with brick, cement, the mixture of brick and cement, and this has silicon compounds. Even your paints has certain silicon compounds, which gives it the rich texture it has. Continuously stone grinding can also lead to uptake of silicon compounds and by the workers of construction site they are continuously inhaling this silicon compounds which leads to silicosis uh, they may also develop tuberculosis and pulmonary hypertension now persistent coughing for a longer duration of time and 
just being in contact still in the silicon compound region or particles of silicon compounds are inhaled it may lead to blockage of respiratory tract which may eventually or later on lead to allergic tuberculosis reactions or it may develop into pulmonary hypertension now pulmonary hypertension may lead to choking of your heart vessels or heart valves the blood flow may be constricted because silicon compounds as such which your body is unable to remove it clogs your pores of your body and it may even clog your pharyngeal region larynx larynx region and the alveolar sac will be unable to distribute properly the passage of oxygen and carbon dioxide or eventually distribute oxygen to the tissues and remove out carbon dioxide silicosis basically happens due to high exposure of silicon dust present in all the materials that are used at a construction site The next occupational disease can be termed as asbestos. Now asbestos is an occupational disease if you are working in any refinery which could be a petrol refinery, which could be a crude oil refinery, which could be a diesel refinery and people working out there may not be subjected to proper prevention techniques. Now they are caused by inhalation of asbestos fiber for a long duration. Asbestos fiber basically is present in crude, petrol, diesel, mineral oil and during the filtration process or purification process asbestos fibers may be inhaled if properly care is not taken out, inhalers or proper masks are not given out. Basically ill treatment of the workers or employees may lead to them condition called as asbestos. The worker in asbestos mining area are at greater risk of developing asbestos. So asbestos is a disease that basically happens in occupational lung disease category. Base both silicosis and asbestos happen to adult people. Obviously, they are the people who are working at such mining places or petrol refineries or crude oil refineries. Silicosis and asbestos is never caused in young children or in children below teenage. And silicosis and asbestos, if taken at proper care time or Care is taken with proper medication and prevention. It can be prevented and cured and further indications of heart deadly disease could be cured. Students, in this part of the chapter, we came across occupational diseases or in simple I can say occupational lung diseases. I hope you all are clear with this concept. Thank you.